again with offending everybody. We got the Drake dating simulator. Drake, I hear you like I'm young. You need to be locked up, buddy. Okay? <laughs> you freaking freak. But anyway, we're going to get it to I hope y'all doing good. Please tell me y'all not on Drake time. And if you are, let me know so I can ban you. And, um... Allegations. Little yeah. Kendrick Lamar has been making some Fortnite, allegations crazy. against Drake recently, saying he has a ghostwriter, tush implants, and secret children. Some may be related, others coerced. Uh, but just because baby Kendrick says it doesn't make it true. <laughs> if anything, he's probably just afraid for his childlike body. So it's important to remember that a song lyric or joke shouldn't be taken seriously. Now with that out of the way, let's get to the next part of the video called How Young is Too Young for Drake? Publicly, the youngest he's gone is 19-year-old Haley Baldwin, which is a little sus but totally legal. However, when asked about it, Haley says she She's known him for four years. Yeah, that's literally grooming, bro. What she was? So what's that? So she, he he knew knew Haley when she was fifteen. Yeah, that's literally grooming, bro. Nah, big dog. Nah, big dog. I don't know what it is. Drake a little too uncom too comfortable around little little people. Well, not little people. Let me say nothing. Around younger women, bro. That's a little odd, man. That's a little odd, especially the Millie Bobby Brown joint. And you kissing a fan, a 17 year old fan, you kissed her left cheek, right cheek, her forehead, and on the lips. Like, come on, bro. Come on, bro. That's insane. That's just, that's just good. When she was 15, he was 30. Oh, but that's just one girl, right? Wrong. Because he also allegedly dated 18 year old model Bella Harris, which again, totally legal and not weird at all, until you figure out he's known her since she was 16. Drake is basically putting girls on pre order. Let other diddlers know there's a cue. Sorry, busy downloading trauma. You can have it right after I corrupt it. It's not his fault. The younger you are, the better your DLC package. Just ask future those <laughs> victim, Millie Bobby Brown, who's been texting Drake since she was 14. We just yeah. texted each other the other day, and he was like, I miss you so much. I was like, I miss you more. Yeah, that's so crazy. And I could kind of somewhat sort of understand it if she did music. Like, if she was like an artist or something. And, and Drake was like, oh, I'm a fan of, like, your music because he in music, too. I could get that a little bit. But, like, y'all in two completely different fields. And then I seen one pic. I'll probably throw it up. A pic of, of Drake taking a picture of Millie Bobby Brown when they was on a yacht at night. I'm telling you, bro. You got to keep your eye out for that Drake guy. Music fire. I ain't going to lie. But when it come to, around, when it come to like, the teenage girls... You gotta keep your eye around around Drake, bro. That's that's weird, bro. That's mad weird. Odd. Every guy watching this knows I miss you means I'm thirsty. You might as well text I'm guilty. Uh, but you know what? Maybe I'm looking into this too much. What did you guys text about, Millie? Uh, about boys. He helps me. Oh, I'm sure he is. Letting you know exactly that's how so to groom yourself before going out. But what specific information did he give you about the boys? You know, that stays in the text messages. <laughs> that sounds so federal. <laughs> Oh, predators that always bad. make me cry. That stays in the text messages. Just an adult having a private conversation with a child. Nothing to see that here. What do you think bad, the over-under is Drake texted her the fiddle <laughs> mantra of it'll be our little secret or no one needs to know. I mean, I'm not saying he's a predator, but he's definitely using their playbook. Starting with let me help you with the boys to let me help you with flirting to let me help you with <laughs> stuff. Do you want to accidentally poop on your future hubby? Yeah. No? Well, then you gotta practice. Oh, but those are just allegations. It's not like Drake actually bediddled someone underage, right? Someone wrong. Because there's video footage of him bringing a 17 year old girl on stage then yeah. proceeding to kiss her as he grinds up on her pretty disgusting but not yeah, technically illegal as it happened in colorado with nah, it, wait, it's 17. It, however still that's still weird man we can't we can't be doing that bro we can't be doing that it's still like like even if the age of consent was 15 that's weird if the if the illegal adult age was 16 that would still be weird bro it's weird and then too in the in the video of him at the concert with the girl like he was all up on her, grinding her, kissing on her neck, like bro. And then when she, when he found out she was seventeen, he's like, "Oh, why you look like that? Like, yo, you you gonna get me in trouble? The 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 the, the titties though, like you look so good, but you seventeen, like bro. And I know it was a long time ago, but bro, still, especially considering all his 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 track records, bro. Nah. He That's didn't good. know this until after kissing her. And once he does find out, he says... So yeah, he that's crazy. <laughs> what do you think he does next? Did you guys double down and say... Why you look like that? Why you... That's what... Yep, he just starts fanning her with his red flag. But then he asks her to take a seat, right? No, he triples down and says... I, I don't know if I should feel guilty or not, but I... You should! I like the way you're... 
<laughs> That's right, after potentially committing a crime, he wanted everyone to know he had no remorse. Like, I don't know how he got away with that. That's like, that's actually, I mean, 2011, I feel like pre, that was like pre cancel culture. So, as crazy as that is, I don't think people really care too much about that. If, if that was 10 years later, like 2021, I think that was in 2011. If this was 2021, good. Bro would have been, bro would have been packed up and, and up out of here, bro. And I know what you're thinking. That must be it. What could he have possibly done to make the situation worse aside from kissing her hands, her cheeks, her forehead, and her lips? Oh, that's that's all I need to see, that's officer. Good. Take him away. <laughs> Seriously, there's I got caught up in the moment, and then there's when you're famous, they just let you do it. Sometimes I don't even ask for permission. Not just invite him on stage and grab them by the hymen. Let's face it, people, there's been a awesome lot of Donald warning Trump. signs. Did you forget his song Nice where he says high school pics? He was even bad then. Or six months yeah. ago where he posted a video shot in a middle school. I'm starting to think he leaked his own. Nah, I mean, that, that's that was just use highly accurate descriptions of it from his victims as evidence against him in court. Sorry, Stacy, we all know it looks like a Pringles can. So, unless your tears were recording, I think we're done here. And let's not forget the wow. most damning evidence Heartbeat Six. If I was fing young girls, I promise I'd have been done arrested. I'm way too famous for that shit you suggested. Yeah, like this whole song was trash, bro. You can't be, you can't be saying that like that. I'm way too famous for that. You you suggest that I would have been arrested, like bro. We got P Diddy, we got uh, 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 Dan Snyder, we got uh, plenty of people, bro. Uh, Jeff Epstein, like bro. Just cause you said that, that if anything, him just spitting this made it made him look even worse, bro. He shouldn't even just he shouldn't even put this up, bro. <laughs> he didn't even put this hard part six up. Which only proves three things. One, life imitates art. There is no quicker way for people to think that you are diddling kids than by writing a song about it. Two, his ghostwriter deserves more credit, because clearly this was all him. And three, Drake doesn't have friends. He doesn't. Only Leech is trying to suck money out of him. A true friend uh, would have said, bro, are you insane? You're going to put out a song yeah, with yeah, like 10 references to porking? But instead, his homies were like, yeah, that shit's dope. Send it. Maybe that's Drake's problem. Too many people around him telling him yes. I mean, think about it. He's Drake. That he could have any woman he wants. Everywhere he he walks our pet stores of kitties just begging to be bought. But if you could have any woman, does yeah. that make them less desirable? We all know hunting is part of the appeal. Getting someone to go on a date, come back to your place, and salad is hard. But the thought of it possibly happening makes you hard. You see, men don't want to be handed trophies. We want to win a trophy. So even though Drake's at a buffet, he can't help but crave Sour Patch Kids. I mean, monsters got to eat too, right? So maybe we should start being... That's a, that's, that's, that's a crazy analogy. About wanting to hunt and wanting that basically that freaking forbidden fruit, which you know is like taboo. That's that's gross, bro. That's gross. I mean, a, a lot of the celebrities, and it's not even just Drake. It's a lot of them like that, bro. Freaking Tiger dating Kylie when she was seventeen, no, and known Kylie since she was like what thirteen, fourteen, performing at her party, and then made a whole song about dating Kylie, basically underage. I know she was young, but. And I should have waited, but she a big girl. She stimulated, like, bro. Nah, niggas is weird, bro. Niggas is weird. Being a little less judgmental and a little more empathetic. Because say what you want about Drake, but that man never speeds in the school zone. Or as he calls it, window shopping. Sometimes he That's just shakes a Gucci bag out the window to get their attention. And he's always looking both ways at crosswalks again and again and again. Sure, once he gets a whiff of their innocence, he can't be stopped. But what are we going to do? Investigate his potential crimes and give his victims some justice? <laughs> You think that's gonna work? You can take the kids out of his house, but you can't take the kids out of his mind. He'll always be hunting for forbidden fruit, even if it's not ripe yet. Drake is a VIP, or very impatient Oh, Rapper is only one P away from trauma. Think about it. Drake said his favorite game is blackjack, probably because he's always hitting on 14 and 15 and stopping at 21. Ah, why does being so wrong <laughs> God, so good. right, he says in front of Build-A-Bear. She's turning 18, <laughs> that to Drake good. means that meat is about to expire. Can we all accept this difference between a joke and violence? Like on March 7th, one of Drake's security guards was shot outside his house. Can we all agree that's wrong? Because if anyone's shooting their shot, it's Drake yeah. during prom night. This. Is why is he cooking him like this? Mm, you know what you want to do? Oh, you want to push that subscribe button? Oh, push the button. Push the button. And then look at this. I never looked twice at no teenager. The whole time, just fibbing. The whole heart part six was a whole bunch of like cap. And I don't know, like I said, I don't know what was going through Drake Mind when he, when he dropped that, bro. Like, you already lost the battle. And then putting that up made it look, made you look 50 times worse. Like, you might as well. And then you still doing stuff like you, you still posting stuff, acting like you're unbothered. You going bowling 
you naming your, yourself at, at the bowling alley, 6'9 guy, like, bro, stop it, bro. Like, what you trying to do, what you think you trying to do is not working, bro. You, you, look, you look worse, bro. Just all you got to do is just come out with some fire music, and it got to be, like, on some classic level of music. People ain't going to forget, but they gonna definitely going to give you a pass. But like, yeah, I know what Drake did was wrong, but he did give us a banger, though. A lot of them be like that, but that's it for the video. Ovi y'all enjoy it. Koi Maxic Koi, a.k.a. your favorite Diddy Party attender, okay? You should come tomorrow. <laughs> I'm just kidding. How about... <laughs>